In Helena, a Democratic state legislator has been identified as the subject of a sexual harassment complaint last year that played a role in the legislature devising its new anti-harassment policy. MTN's chief political reporter Mike Dennison has more on this story. Earlier this month, legislative leaders working on a new anti-harassment policy revealed that something previously undisclosed was a key factor in getting it passed, a sexual harassment claim involving two legislators. The claim happened more than a year ago, and late last week, the Associated Press reported the complaint was made against Democratic State Representative Jonathan Windyboy of Box Elder. Windyboy declined to comment Monday to MTN News, although he indicated he may respond later. Also last week, the legislature released a five-page report on the complaint reportedly filed by a female legislator against Windy Boy. The March 2018 report, completed by Great Falls attorney Jean Foray, was heavily redacted at the request of those involved who asserted their privacy rights. But the document did reveal that the target of the complaint sent several texts to the female legislator in late 2017, saying, you are gorgeous as always, and that you're always a wonderful sight for my sore eyes. Another text said, well, just know between you and me, you can step all over me and there is no boundaries. Foray said comments in the text were inappropriate and that legislative leadership should take action. The investigation had been requested by legislative leadership, which, according to the Associated Press, considered removing Windy Boy from his chairmanship of the State Tribal Relations Committee. He resigned the chairmanship last April, citing work-related commitments. House Speaker Greg Hertz told MTN Monday he wasn't involved in the incident since he was not Speaker at the time and that no further action is planned. House Democratic leadership released a statement last week saying they are shocked and disappointed to learn that one of their members harassed another person. They called the behavior completely unacceptable and said they're still gathering information on the report. Reporting from Helena, Mike Dennison, MTN News. And the new anti-harassment policy enacted just a week ago allows for confidential reporting and investigation of claims and penalties for the offenders.